Hey everyone, Fez here from Crypto Setups. Today I'm going to show you how to install the SWE wallet. It is currently on testnet, devnet, but uh, there's a lot of airdrops and things happening in the background that you can participate in by using some of the applications that are going to launch. So first thing you need to do is set up your wallet. Now the good thing about this wallet is it has the faucet which you need for testnet tokens built into it so you don't have to go anywhere else once you've got your wallet set up you can you can claim your tokens straight from it and these are testnet tokens to use uh, and, tra and process transactions on testnet. So let's dive in. This is the official link in the Chrome store. I'll have it in the notes as well for the video so take a look at that. And once you're there, all you need to do is, it's so easy, add the extension to Chrome. As soon as you've done it, as you can see, it's set it up and it wants you to set up the wallet. So let's just make this a little bit bigger so everyone can see. And let's get started. So if you have an existing, you can import, but if you don't, you set up a new wallet. So let's just work through this. Okay, so you got your password click on create wallet and as usual it is your seed phrase if you if you are new to crypto then may, listen to this if you're not skip over this but this is your seed phrase this is what you will need to use to restore your wallet if anything goes wrong your computer crashes you lose your hard drive as long as you have this seed phrase you can spin up a new computer and add it and it will restore your wallet the option earlier that it gave you you could use it, restore your wallet and put this seed phrase in but you don't want anyone else getting hold of your seed phrase because it doesn't matter if your wallet's fine. If they get a hold of this seed phrase, they can spin it up and put it into a fresh wallet and steal your funds. So this is why it's super important to make sure you are protecting your seed phrase and securing it, have it offline, do something that isn't just putting it on the cloud storage. Do not do that. Anyway, back to it. So we'll copy this. I have copied it and saved it. So now I will hit open and here you go. That's it, so it's that simple, your wallet is installed. Now, a bit about the wallet, so let's take a look. It's very self-explanatory. This is your address, your wallet address. It has a nice copy button. You can send, swap, stake and earn, but obviously DevNet. Um, so over here is where instead of the faucet, you just hit request and give it a moment. And there you go, it takes a little bit, so just wait for a few moments. But that's your coins, these are your NFTs if you had any. Here's some applications, remember you're on DevNet, so you can click on any of these and it'll open up a website and it'll take you there, which is great, and you can connect your wallet, pick your wallet, and you can see here when you wanna to connect to a site and bam, you're connected just like everything else. And this gives you your activity of what the wallet's been up to. And finally, you can go here and you can see where you pick the different networks, terms of service account and uh, the bare bones, um, just the settings and things like that. But that is how you install your SWE wallet. Hopefully this has helped get you started. As always, not financial advice, do your own research. These videos are strictly for tutorial and educational purposes only. Take care everyone, bye.